Hello children, welcome to your maths class. Today we will discuss a very new topic, new thing we are going to discuss, test of divisibility. Okay, in earlier chapter we have already discussed about your operations of large number, then how to solve a problem when so many operations are there, so many things we have already discussed. Today we are going to discuss a new topic, test of divisibility. Divisibility test means what? Test means don't think this is an exam. We are going to give a exam. We are going to check it, verify it without division. How can you say that a number is divisible by another number? Okay. So uh, before going to start this, let me tell you when we are using number like your 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We know numbers are unlimited, uncountable. Okay. So when we are using this, you can see 1, 2, 3. 1 is called your odd number. 2 is called your even number. Okay. Then it's an odd. Then it's an even. So just like a game, odd, even, odd, even, one after another. Okay. Why this is odd? Why this is even? Hmm? So odd number means it is not divisible by 2. We cannot divide completely by 2. And even number means it is completely divisible by 2. This is called your even number. The number which is divisible by 2 is called even number. And the number which is not divisible by 2 that is your odd number okay so without uh, dividing this one thing you remember if the once digit is to 0 2 4 6 8 like this number it's coming then you can say this is an even number if once place is coming 1 3 5 7 9 then this can these things we can say these are odd number so if it is 11, if it is 23, if it is 45, if it is 37, if it is 89. So whatever we can write, only we can see the ones place. So this type of numbers are called odd number because these are not divisible by 2. Means completely not divisible by 2. But this one suppose 10, 22, 44, 36, 78. 178, 436, whatever you can write, only use just this one's place. If this type of numbers are coming 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, then we can say these are even number. So this is your odd and this is your even number. But what we are going to discuss? We are going to discuss without division. How can you say that the numbers are divisible by 2, divisible by 3, divisible by 4, divisible by 5, divisible by 6. Okay, so how can you test it or check it or verify it? We will not divide it without dividing. How can you get the answer? Okay, so let me take one number 1, 3, 5, 8, 6. So this is a 5 digit number. Hmm. So we have to verify whether this number is divisible by 2 or not. For that, one thing you have to remember. Test of 2. A number is divisible by 2. When a number is divisible by 2? If its one's place is an even number. Okay. So this is the statement or this is the formula. Only you have to remember this. No need to divide such a large number. Only by seeing this. I have taken example 1, 3, 5, 8, 6. So according to this statement, one a number is divisible by 2 
if it's one's place is an even number one's place you know from the right side we can calculate one's place so here you can see this is six this is an even number just now we have discussed so if this place is even number means this complete number is divisible by two we have divided no we have not divided but according to this formula this number is divisible by two if i'll take 231 which one is one's place this one one's place is one so one is an odd number yes so odd number means this is not divisible by two okay let me take one uh, more example 1000 or 56 you can write 348 so all these numbers you check the ones place all are we are getting the even number that means all these numbers are completely divisible by 2 okay so this is your formula to remember whether the number is divisible by 2 or not then we will go for test of 3 what is the formula a number this part is over then we will check for 3 a number is divisible by 3 if the sum of all the digits in it is divisible by 3 are you getting my point a number is divisible by 3 let's take an example the same number i'm taking 13586 okay this is one number i have taken a number is divisible by 3 if the sum of all the digits how many digits are there 1 2 3 4 5 sum means what we have to add this so addition of all these digits so i'm writing here 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 8 plus 6 i have taken all the digits and you just add it 314 4, 5, 4, 9, 9, 8, 17, 17 plus 6. How much? 23. We are getting 23. So if sum of all the digits in it is divisible by 3. So whether this 23 is divisible by 3 or not. That we have to check. So is it divisible? Are you thinking? No. It is not divisible by 3. Yes. So if the sum of this number or this digits is not divisible by 3 that means this number is also not divisible by 3 okay so you have to add all the digits first let me take one more example suppose 180 yes so what we are going to do you have to add all the digits how many digits are there Three digits 0 8 plus 1 9 plus 0 that is your 9 so this 9 is divisible by 3 yes or no yes so 9 is divisible by 3 we are getting the value 3 that means this is completely divisible so 180 also divisible by 3 clear everyone so this is your rule 3 now we will check for divisible by 4 this thing we are going to discuss a number is divisible by 4 when a number is divisible by 4 if the last two digit is divisible by 4 or 0 
what I have written? A number is divisible by 4 if I am taking one example 240. This is one number. Okay. So, by seeing this, we have to verify whether this number is divisible by 4 or not. How to verify? If the last two digits, last two digit means one sentence, these two digits is divisible by 4, whether this 14 is divisible by 4 or not. First you check this. 14 is divisible by 4 or not? No, it is not divisible. That means 214 also not divisible by 4. Okay. If last two digit is divisible by 4 or you may write 200 or 2000. Last two digits if it is zeros are there that means this number also divisible by 4. I am showing one more example 716. Okay. So if we follow this rule last two digit is 16. So is the 16 is divisible by 4? Yes, 16 is divisible by 4. That means 716 also divisible by 4. Okay. So these are all about your test. Means to verify it without division. How can you say the numbers are divisible by 2, 3, 4, all these things or not? So children for today, this much only. Next class we will proceed with the same topic with some new rules.